A 44 year old woman is in critical condition after police say she was shot during an incident of road rage. And despite her injuries, they say that woman was able to help them find the other vehicle involved. Steve King joins us live from the West Palm Beach Police Department with detectives next steps before they make an arrest. Steve. Jade, well, investigators of the West Palm Beach Police Department have to go through all the evidence they have and execute some search warrants before they can make an arrest in this road rage shooting. Now, the 44 year old Royal Palm Beach woman who was shot, she's in critical condition at St. Mary's Medical Center. Investigators say this all started near North Australian Avenue and Palm Beach Lakes Boulevard Sunday morning before 830 when people in separate vehicles got into a verbal altercation. The confrontation continued as the cars pulled up to a red light next to the outlet's mall. One of the people in a red 2016 Nissan Altima shot the 44 year old woman driving this gray car, shot her in the neck. Several people who saw it called 911, including the injured woman herself. She was critically wounded, but was able to maintain following the suspect vehicle and along with others provide information that led our detectives uh, to that suspect vehicle. Detectives say she followed the Nissan Altima at least 15 miles up I-95 before she pulled over on the side of the highway where she was eventually airlifted to St. Mary's Medical Center. As for the suspect car, through a multi-agency effort, it was found in Green Acres, then surveilled throughout the day before being pulled over during a traffic stop in Palm Beach Gardens. The three people inside refused to cooperate with police, and officers impounded the car. Investigators did collect evidence at the scene of the shooting, but they will not say exactly what they found. Our detectives are going to leave no stone unturned. They are going to establish probable cause and hold the person or persons responsible for the shooting accountable. And if you have any information about this shooting, you're urged to call West Palm Beach Police or Crime Stoppers. Reporting live in Palm Beach County, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.